Monday. Monday, Joe. What another great day. Still going. No breakdowns this week, so that's fantastic. All right, guys, it's Monday. You see we're on Joe's truck. It's still running, so that means it's a great day. So we're going to check out and see what he's got. You guys, come on. guys, how you doing? I hope you had a great day, great weekend. I know I did. It was busy. Busy, got, busy. Look at this. We got Bob Bates here. Look at this. There's three, six, seven. Woo. We're He's rolling. Win, We're it? rolling. Um, I'll say thank you, Mr. Bob Bates. Um, I know there's more for there, but uh, we're going to catch up on that next week. Looks well, like you loaded up the truck. It's the right. full. Yeah. Uh, Ryan Hampton of Idaho. You guys are going to be hearing about this young man. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. Uh, yeah, we got a lot of tools. So let me tell you. We're going to start here. There have been people waiting for these. Oh, yeah. Those are cool. We have the limited edition, limited run, Knipix Black Handle. And let me tell you, people have been eating these up already. Those are cool. They are. It's going to be done one time, and that's it. Never so, again. So, guys that have uh, texted me and I said I'd be holding some for you, give me a call back. I got you on my list, but uh, just give me a text back because I got it all saved for you. Cool. And we'll get uh, start stuff head sending out to you, okay? Those look really good. That's the first time I've seen them other than, you know, at the shows. Good. It's cool they, to have something a little different. They are nice, and yes, I'm gonna have a pair in my uh, in my toolbox. I love them. They I are made the Joe collection. They, right? they, they are sweet. <laughs> We're gonna jump over to Vim body clip mini pliers. Yep. For pulling the clips out. I mean, look at that. It's mm -hmm. like I've been eating them all all day. Now you guys may notice something different on these. See the tips. The other ones were a BCT1, and they have different tips on them than those. Those were for the big flat ones, and these yep. are for the push type. Yep. So shows you a little yep, bit had, different. I had people saying, "Oh, I got those." I go, "No, nope, those are different." These are new. And I had to look at them. It's like, so yeah, I've been going through these too, like hotcakes on Saturday morning. They are awesome. Yep. So, so don't get them confused if you just see the handle because they look alike, but they're they, completely different. The they are. It's, it's a nice, perfect handle. Fits in your hand just right. The other one's a button clip tool. And these are body clips. So, so there you go. There cool. we go. Cool deal. What's the price on those? They're 35 Okay. Uh, I think pretty much the same price as the other ones. Beats pulling them out with a plastic, you know, a pocket yep. screwdriver and bending them and breaking them and... We have master Power combo. Probe 4 Master Combo Kit. Okay. So, so this one has the ECT 3000, which is the short finder, as well as the Probe Kit and the Power Probe 4. So you got three kits in one. So you got the Power Probe 4 kit. The short finder kit and the lead kit all in one so if you guys are not familiar with the ECT 3000 it's this piece and this piece so the way that works you hook that up to your wiring dog you know your wiring like let's say for instance you're working on a 16 foot trailer an enclosed trailer car trailer whatever and you've got a short maybe in the tail light itself the wire Somewhere. runs in the tail light so you would hook this at the front of the trailer, and when you pull the receiver, which is this part, down the line, you'll see the lights on it here. It will run up as you get closer. So it'll show you the shorts this way, and when you get to it, the light will come on in the center, 
If you go Perfect. past it, it will show the other one. To go back up, buddy. So then you there can just you trim your wire loom, and you can find out where the wire is broke. This thing is an amazing tool. If you guys work on trailers. Now, do you guys be right at the wire loom when you get at it? You'll be pretty close to it. Okay, because... So. I was told you could be like two, three inches away yeah, from it. Yeah, you got to be pretty close to and, it. And know. that's what I'm trying to let people know is you yeah. don't have to have the wire loom completely out. You can no, be... I, I always try to... I think you really have to almost touch it for you, it to work good. But, you want to be close, but... Uh, but it definitely works. This thing is a lifesaver for you guys, especially if you're working on big truck trailers because we used to find shorts on those things. It makes it super, super, super easy and simple with this. Somebody brings in a trailer that's got a... Oh, our rat nest, nest of yeah. all kinds of wires, you know, been jumped and mm -hmm. patched and everything. But this kit right here is well worth the money because of this itself. Now, the power probe is an awesome tool for you guys that don't know it. I've got a couple of videos you can just check on YouTube, type in coon truck and power probe. Yep. And we've got one we did with the power probe guys, but the one we did without the power probe guys, we actually put it to the test and showed how it works with a blower motor and stuff like that. You can apply power and ground to it. Um, when you're checking connectors, if you don't know which one's hot or which one's ground, it will show it for you. But this set comes with the Pearson probes. I've actually got this set, that's why I know so much about yep. this one. Um, for you guys that don't know how this works, it's got the Pearson probes here. So that's the one that you would put on the wire itself. If I can get this one out. This one is my favorite one because it has a needle. You know, of course, if you're working on trailer wiring, you're gonna be using a lot smaller stuff. I need my camera to focus. But that thing will actually pierce into the wiring and you'll be able to check your connections that way. I think it goes over. Yeah. And Power Probe will tell you too, just go on YouTube and watch their videos because they put probes, they put videos out for. But those, this is a fantastic kit. That ECT 3000 is an amazing tool for you guys that's doing electrical diagnostic work. On trucks, trailers, whatever. I mean, I don't work on a car, but obviously it's easier to get the wiring harness on trailers, and that thing's gonna save you a buttload of time. And this here is for five hundred dollars, but okay. if you bought the Power Probe Four and, and separately the uh, Short Finder kit separately and the Lead kit separately, you'd be paying way more than that. So cool. That that's that. I have. We gotta talk about a little Milwaukee. I have the new, we're going to say it is the 296720. Okay. This thing has 1,600 foot-pounds of breakaway torque. Ooh. It is the same as a three-quarter inch. Right. It is two inches shorter, two pounds later, and it's got all the cool lights on there. And let me tell you, it also has what everybody's been wanting, the anti-vibration. Mm -hmm. It's about time they do that. Hanging on to the battery, keeping them from falling apart, vibrating out, vibrating loose on here. That's a good thing. <laughs> All right, so I want to cover something real quick with Milwaukee because okay. I've had guys ask me this before. All right. So they don't understand what's going on here. So the 2967 is the tool number, okay? Right. So dash 20 is tool only. Two only. 21 comes with a tool, one battery. 22 comes with a tool two. and two yeah. batteries. Two batteries. So, yep. There you go. A little Milwaukee knowledge for you. Um, we're just going to switch here real quick. Oh, Have you seen this? Yeah. Okay. You know what's amazing with this? It's how quiet this is. I got this for 325. It's a two gallon air 18 volt air compressor. The batteries fit under there to hold a 12 amp hour battery, of course. Okay. All 18 volt batteries. Goes up to 180 PSI. Um, one more thing here. 
That's a nice rig right there. Venom HP. Let's see if I can do that. There we go. And we have the mini doctor. Okay. Now, what's cool with the mini doctor is. It now has a quick lock. Quick change lock, yeah. So you can take it to open, pull it out, lock it, holds it in. For those of you guys that haven't seen this, of course we could plug it in and all that, but it would literally take, if I put this in here and turned it on, not even 11 seconds for this nut to be glowing red hot. Yeah. And what it does is it heats from the outside in, so the nut it, it gets hot before the bolt. It expands off of the bolt, where it torch you heat them both up same time. And then when you go to twist it, you twist it's the bolt turn, off. Yeah. And what this does is it heats the nut off, so when you go to twist it, it frees it up. No spark, no flame. Yep, nice and safe. And beautiful cover girl. It gives you, there's this felt protector which is used in some cases, and I didn't get to read into what it does, but um, I think it's got, it's got uses. But uh, here's, they give you one coil you can bend to your shape that you need in case it's an oblong shape. Right. You got this rope, like the rope-a-dope, which you can fit over Whatever you any, need. any other kind of things. So you get the coil, these three that come with it. And then they have, different coil packs which you can get. Yep. So there's a big coil pack, there's the long coil pack. If you guys haven't seen the video, you can look back on my channel. We showed it. If you'll just type in coon trucking induction innovations, you'll be able to see yep. the video we did where but we did the test one and he explains all the coil yep. packs. One of the new ones which is pretty cool is the thin wall for people that have the wheel lug nuts mm -hmm. and they lose them or they're they're broke or stripped on there right. just they're real thin they fit in there between so you can heat up the lug nut off of the stud yep. i think that's a cool set there right there cool deal so a lot of stuff to cover real quick um anything you need give me a call give me a text and uh We'll see what we have new uh, for you next week. There you go. All right, guys. If you see anything you need off Joe's truck, his number's right down here at 731-412-7295. Shoot him a text message, and he'll get back with you. Like always, thanks for hanging out with us. It's Monday. Hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes in the description. If you're not subscribed, you take your finger and you click that button. You guys have a great week. See ya.